drag copying and transforming again. They sound so complicated, but they are actually quite simple. And talk about Speed Demon. This is a great way to um, create a fast repeating pattern in record time. SSP, uh, simple, straightforward, right to the point. No screwing around, so let's start. Uh, we're talking about drag copying, and I'm working on a Mac. So to drag copy an object, I use my Option key. But if you're working on a PC, um, then you'd be using the Alt button. We're going to use it in combination with the Shift key. So let me show you how it works. Uh, okay, let's say I start with a simple. Now, my objective here is to create a repeating pattern. And watch how quickly we can do this. All right, so I'm going to go back to my um, selection tool. I hold down the Alt and Shift key. Uh, actually, first when I hold down the Alt, notice how my symbols changed. Um, that means I'm going to copy this as I click and drag it. Now, when I start to do that, I suddenly push down on the Shift button, and it constrains it to this uh, horizontal. So it's less likely to move. Once I get it to where I'm going, I let go of the mouse, and I just have drag copied my square. Let's change its color. Uh, sure, why not? Just to make it stand out a little Christmassy for us. And I'm going to do the same thing again, and you're going to see why here in a moment. So I'm going to shift select both objects, option button down on a Mac, alt on a PC, click and drag, hold down the shift key, and I've just done it again. Now, this is the quick key that people talk about. It's Control D, or otherwise known as Transform Again. And it's just going to repeat the pattern that I just did. Watch this. Control, uh, Command D on a, on a uh, PC. It's obviously Control D. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. That's it. That's it. Look how quickly we were able to do that. Control A, select all. Uh, now, we're going to just repeat that, except this time on the vertical. Now, if we want a checkerboard pattern, no sweat. Let's just spin this. It's going to automatically grab it at the center of the axis. And um, we're just going to go ahead. I, I'm using the rotate tool. 180 degrees is basically a turnaround. So uh, I've got the preview turned on. That's why we can see how it's working. So we're going to go ahead and say, yeah, let's do that. Bam. So now I have a repeating checkerboard. Control A, select all. Let's go back to our drag copy. Go back to my move tool. I'm sorry, my select tool. I'm thinking Photoshop for a second. It's option. Click and drag. Hold down the shift key. And now I'm going to just do my control D trick. Oh, command D. I keep forgetting which computer I'm on. Command D. Boom, boom, boom. And how quickly was that? How fast was that? We just, um, by using the drag copy feature along with the uh, transform again, which is command D, we just made a checkerboard in no time at all. Hey, and here's one more little trick for you. Check this out. Some people don't know this one. Watch this. All right, space bar, make the hand tool. Uh, your boss says, or, or you think, you know, I don't like the red. Uh, the red's no good. I like the green, but not the red. Um, so I have to go through and select all of them. I can use the shift key, right? I'll just go through and use the shift key and select every single red. That's a, that's a bit of work. No, you don't have to do that. Watch this. Check it out. I can select one red, select, same, Fill. Bam. Now I have all the reds. I don't like red. I want it pink instead. Boom. Simple. That's what being a speed demon is all about. Thanks so much for watching.